So now, do you know where some of these national parks are located in the United States? Well, after today's lesson, I'm sure you'll know more. On my home page, take your mouse and set it on fourth grade. Slide down to National Park PBL. Click. Over the next few months, we'll be exploring national parks. In fact, your family is interested in taking a vacation to visit some of our national parks. They want to spend eight days and seven nights on this adventure, but they haven't worked out all the details. They want you to do all the planning. Let's slide down. The goals for this trip are to fly to a nearby city where you will begin the road trip. You'll need to rent transportation. You'll be visiting three national parks in the United States in at least two different states. We'll only be visiting the full national parks. No memorials or monuments on this trip. You'll only be visiting parks in the lower 48 states. We won't be driving to Alaska or flying to Hawaii. The return flight home will be from a different city. We'll be keeping track of all of our information in a site called Google Keep. We'll use Google Keep to take our notes. Click on Google Keep. Google Keep is a great place to take notes. Right in the middle of the screen, I'll click on Take a Note. The title will be National Park Trip. Today, I want you to write down at least five national parks that you might be interested in going to. You'll keep track of them here in Google Keep. Where it says, take a note, you'll click, and you'll write down the national park names. Below that, there are a few things that you can do with your note. You can change the color of your note. You can add pictures and you can share it. And then under the three dots, you can add a drawing or make a copy, or even copy to Google Docs. I'll explain more about Google Keep as we go. But for right now, let's go back to my web page. On my web page, I have a list of all of the national parks. Scroll down. This list is an alphabetical list of all of the national parks. It starts with Acadia National Park. If you put your mouse on it, it drops down to a link. Click the link to go to that park. This opens up the web page of Katy National Park. Scroll down. At the top, there is a list of planning your vacation. There's also a link to learning about the park. And a link to getting involved. To find out about the park, go to basic information, places to go, things to do. Look at pictures. Would you be interested in visiting Acadia National Park? If so, go to the top of your screen to Google Keep. Take a note, Acadia National Park. Go back to the list on my webpage. What's another national park that you might want to go to? Let's try Mammoth Cave. Click on it. Go to the link. Read about Mammoth Cave. Click on Plan Your Visit. Learn about the park or get involved. Is this a national park that you would want to visit on a vacation? Go to Google Keep and write it down. 
Let's go back to my web page. In addition to the list, scroll down. I also have a PDF Trekking the National Park Information Guide. Slide down. This is also a list of all of the national parks in the United States. Each page is a national park. You can read about it. Slide down. Read about the national parks here as well. Also, as you scroll down, there is a map. This map will show you where all of the national parks are in the United States. The national parks are the trees. Blue pins are airports. So you want to be thinking, where could you fly in and out if you visited these different national parks? We're here in Pittsburgh. What's the closest national park? Click on the tree. This is Cuyahoga Valley National Park. Click on the link. It'll take you to the website of Cuyahoga Valley National Park. Is this a park that you would be interested in visiting? Go to Google Keep. Write it down. Remember, write at least five different national parks that you would like to visit if you're going on this vacation. If you have any questions, let me know or email me and I'll see you next week.